I don't know about you guys, but October is my absolute favorite month. Probably because it's my birthday month and I just like fall in general. I feel like a lot of people like fall, but I love fall and I like Halloween. I just think it's the whole month is just awesome. So I switched to the original Nightmare Mount. Probably my favorite mount in the game. Honestly, this is just like my OG mount. And I was super excited to get this from the Nightmare Pack years and years ago. And uh, yeah, I just love it. So we're going we're, we're going back with the original Blaze Life Hammer look with this mount. But what I want to talk about in this video is the uh, new teasers that we've been getting for the next test drum update. There's always a big test drum update in the, uh, the month of October. So we're getting that really soon. They even said in the newsletter that this is happening soon. So it could be next week. I don't know. It could be next week, the week after, but we'll have to wait and see on that. But we got some theories. We got some, I don't know, just little teasers to look at and stuff like that. So I'm excited. There's a lot of things happening soon. And uh, yeah, it's kind of got like the uh, the feeling of past years where we've had like big world updates. This isn't a big world update, but it's still something to get excited about because uh, I'm hopeful that there's some cool gear, this, you know, new dungeon. It hasn't been confirmed that it's a dungeon, but a lot of people think that. And I'm, I'm hoping they're going that route because it just makes sense. But the first thing is uh, from the newsletter. And this is actually the original newsletter. It had this, uh, you know, couple sentences. But they changed it later. So I'm going to go with the, the one that I took a screenshot of when it originally came out. So here it is. And uh, it says, Don't risk digging yourself into a hole or falling through a manhole cover to some unknown dark realm below the city. Struggling to guess. So they mention digging yourself into a hole. Which, which you know, everyone's called it the Old Town Tunnel. The Old Town Hole. The, just the hole. I don't know. And uh, also, they call it the uh the manhole cover to some unknown dark realm which i think is cool because that kind of makes it seem like it's some kind of sewer though sewers in this game in the past and in pirate i feel like people have not really liked the whole sewer aspect we had a sewer in uh, xanadu and imperia and yeah not my favorite place so i hope it's not really you know centered around a sewer because i feel like we've really had that a lot in this game <laughs> and in pirate so yeah but it could be. I mean, maybe a part of it is like a sewer. It does make sense because it's underneath Wizard City. And that's where like a sewer system would be. So I can understand that. But I hope it just... I really hope it doesn't look like the sewers that we've seen in previous worlds. Where they just kind of use that and be like, Okay, we're going to take the Xanadu sewer and we're going to put it here. And then that'll be like the main part that the, uh, the players have to go through. I hope it's not that. I hope it looks a lot different. And they change it up because... If that's all it is, I mean, yeah, I'm going to be a little disappointed in that because we've seen that sewer <laughs> many times in uh, in different worlds. So we had the newsletter teaser and we also had a video teaser that was released earlier. And this is from one of the animators that works in Wizard 101, Tony Gaddis. And uh, he put out a minute long uh, video of him animating one of the new mobs or enemies or something that's going to be in the, the tunnels or the sewers, whatever it's going to be. So... I'm going to show that to you guys. Pay attention to the music because the music is new and it's probably included somewhere in the Old Town Tunnels. So here it is. So that was the animation process on one of the new mobs that I'm guessing it's going to be a mob that's going to be in the Old Town Tunnel because this doesn't really look like a character that's going to be like an NPC like talking to us or anything like that giving us quests. It looks like it's just going to be a mob that we beat up at some point in the Old Town Tunnel. So this is the Fly Worker and um, people have said that they think it's going to be Myth maybe by the, the casting or something but yeah we got a Myth Mob Fly Worker that is in full construction gear 
He's got a hat with like a light on it and he's got a shovel. So I don't know what they're doing down there. Some kind of excavation, some kind of like building of things that are happening by these bug creatures underneath the city. This makes me feel like there's going to be a lot of other bug type of creatures when we go down there. I'm hoping there's a lot more than just bugs. So it's not like a chrysalis type of thing that we're, you know, every creature is some kind of like bug or rat. I mean, there's probably going to be rats if it's going to be a sewer, right? But I hope it's not the same kind of mobs that we've seen before where they just kind of take chrysalis and be like, oh, bugs and rats. That's that's basically chrysalis. And then, you know, that's it. OK, so now it's time to move on to some theories about the Old Town Tunnels and what it could be, because there's going to be a story wrapped around this. If it is a new dungeon like Darkmoor, which is what everyone's comparing it to, even though I feel like it's not going to be as good as Darkmoor because Darkmoor is like the original, like high tier dungeon level 100. And this one's going to be level 130. But I don't know. I hope the story is good and it makes sense because um, that's going to be really exciting because I love when we get new stories from Wizard City because this is going to be in Wizard City just, you know, underneath. And uh, I'm excited for that. So we're going to get some kind of new story on uh, what's going on down underneath Wizard City. The word catacombs has been thrown around. I think this was data mined at some point, And I'm guessing that there's going to be some area underneath Wizard City that is a catacomb of, you know, past wizards or just past people that have lived here because I don't know if everyone in Wizard City was always a wizard since Merle Ambrose kind of came along and created Ravenwood and all the schools and everything like that. So I don't know what it was before that. And that would be something that I would love to explore more in the storyline if they do that. So that's kind of what I'm excited for. If we get some history of Wizard City from the Old Town Tunnel. So that's like if that is what they're going with on this one, then I would be super excited for that. So I want some kind of Wizard City past storyline, basically before Ravenwood with Merle Ambrose and like what was going on here before that. What if there's like ancient civilizations down there or something like buildings that have sunken down, kind of like the Death School did, even though the Death School just went to Nightside, but there could be buildings down there or like, you know, ancient civilizations that have just been like left behind and buried, something like that. Like that would be pretty cool. So I could see that. And then with these kind of ancient civilizations, what if there were like ghosts? I mean, if we're going to a catacomb, then there's probably going to be some kind of ghosts down there. So that's what I'm also kind of feeling is going to happen is we're going to be finding some ancient wizard ghost. I want to, I want to fight an ancient wizard ghost. So we could be seeing ghosts down there. We obviously are going to be seeing bugs down there as well. And uh, yeah, I'm excited for the storyline of it too, because like the past of Wizard City is always something that I wanted to see. And I wanted to see that explored more. And I feel like this is a good chance for them to do that. So that is what I'm looking forward to. But there's some cool stuff going on. And um, I hope it's more catacombs themed than sewer themed. But there could, I mean, there could be parts that are sewers. But I hope that there's some unique mobs. I mean, this fly worker is a new mob. So I'm excited for new mobs like that. Hopefully there's more. And uh, yeah, I hope it, they do a good job of the story. Also, of course, most people want there to be good gear. If they're doing dungeons, like the next tier of dungeon for level 130, then there's going to be better gear. The only thing I'm not sure of is if they're going to make the gear better than Darkmoor. Is the Storm Robe going to be better than the Darkmoor Robe? If it is, then you know, I'll be pretty impressed because we'll be basically getting our complete new set of gear from this. And I hope it's better than Paradox gear, like more balanced gear and... I hope the robes are something that we can actually use because robes have been a weird thing in this game. They have changed how they made robes since Darkmoor. Maybe they'll go back to that, but we'll have to see. I hope it's like balanced stats for everyone from this dungeon. Make it like Darkmoor. I hope they give us a spell because I feel like if it's going to be a Darkmoor like dungeon, I want a spell for each school. So I'm planning on a spell and new gear, new storyline of you know looking into the past of wizard city and what happened before we were here before ravenwood when merle ambrose was i don't know creating the schools and creating he created wizard city too right so i mean he definitely created ravenwood so i'm guessing he was like you know the founding person of wizard city but yeah let me know what you guys think of it 
and uh, let me know what you guys think of the teaser so far are we gonna get more teasers maybe but if it's coming out soon then maybe i don't know we could get like one more so it seems like test realm is coming out pretty soon but i feel like the new pack is gonna come out before that so new halloween pack soon which is in wizard and pirate so i'll probably make a video on that a lot of cool things happening soon i'll be going through the comments seeing what you guys think of it but if you made it all the way through this video, if you're excited for the test room soon, please leave a like on this video to show your support. Subscribe if you haven't so you know when I post all those videos on the new stuff. And I'll see you guys next time.